Hi, thanks for joining me today. My name is Mr. Allen, and today I wanted to read you a story, Who Sank the Boat? by Pamela Allen. Now, while her name is also Allen, we're not related. Well, let's start reading the story, Who Sank the Boat? And let's see if you can figure out who sank the boat. Who Sank the Boat? by Pamela Allen. Oh, that looks like a nice little spot. I wonder if that's a lake? Could it be a pond? Or maybe it's even the ocean. Let's find out. Beside the sea, on Mr. Peffer's place, there lived a cow, a donkey, a sheep, a pig, and if you can see it, a tiny mouse. So the question is, who sank the boat, right? They were good friends. And on one warm sunny morning, for no particular reason, they decided to go for a row on the bay. Do you know who sank the boat? And there's our boat. They're all walking out to it. Was it the cow who almost fell in when she tilted the boat and made such a din? Well, looks pretty close. Let's find out. No. It wasn't the cow who almost fell in. Do you know who sank the boat? Don't tell anyone if you do. It's good to be surprised. Was it the donkey who balanced her weight, who yelled, I'll get in at the bow before it's too late? No, it wasn't the donkey who balanced her weight. Do you know who sank the boat? Was it the pig, as fat as butter, who stepped in at the side and caused a great flutter? Well, that looks pretty close to tipping. Let's find out if that boat sank. No, it wasn't the pig, as fat as butter. Do you know who sank the boat? Well, not many friends left, are there? Was it the sheep who knew where to sit to level the boat so that she could knit? Well, that's a nice hobby. You get to create things too. Do you have a hobby where you can create? Let's see if it was the sheep. No, it wasn't the sheep. Who knew where to sit? Do you know who sank the boat? Was it the little mouse, the last to get in, who was lightest of all? Could it be him? Well, that's quite the leap the mouse is taking through the air. You do know who sank the boat. Well, look at that. It was the mouse all the time. Oh, and look at those friends. They are all dripping wet. Except for the mouse, who seemed <laughs> to not get wet. And there's that poor boat. Oh, and the umbrella. I hope they go back and they get the umbrella, the oar, and get that boat. Thanks for joining me. Hope we'll talk again soon and I'll be able to tell you another story. Bye-bye.